I worked on them for a while and how it would be like. <laughs> like if they come and I would be like, the earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. Through the prayers of our Holy Fathers, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy on us and save us. Spirit. 
Then I will teach transgressors your ways, and the ungodly shall turn back to you. Deliver me from my guiltiness, O God, the God of my salvation, and my tongue shall sing the of your righteousness. O Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. For if you desire sacrifice, I would have given it. With whole burnt offerings, you will not be pleased. A sacrifice to God is a broken spirit, a broken and contrite heart, O God, you will not despise. Do good, O Lord, to Zion, and your good pleasure in the walls of Jerusalem will be built. Then you will be pleased with the sacrifice of righteousness, with oblation, and whole burnt offerings. Then they shall offer you a bulls on the altar. Attend to my help, O God, make haste to help me, O Lord. Let them be ashamed and confounded to seek my soul. Let them be turned back and brought to shame who desire evils from me. Let them be turned back and brought to shame who say to me, Jerry, well done, well done. And let all those who seek me rejoice and be glad in me, O God, and let those who love their salvation say continually from my kingdom and God. But I am the Lord and needy, help me, O God, to know my help and my redeemer, O Lord, and not to lay. Hear my prayer, O Lord, give ear to my supplication and your faithfulness, hear me in your righteousness. Enter not into judgment for your servant, for in your sight no man living shall be judged for God. For the enemy has persecuted my soul, he has humbled my life to the ground. He has made me fill with darkness like those who have wandered in bed. Therefore my spirit is overwhelmed within me, my heart within me is troubled. I remember the days of old, I meditated on all your works, and these are the works of your hands. I spread out my hands to you, my soul long to you, like a thirsty wind. Hear me speedily, O Lord, my spirit fails, for that your face for me must be really like those who go down into the pit. Make me to hear your mercy in the morning, for you I hope. To make me to know, O Lord, the way in which I should walk, for I have lifted up my soul to you. Deliver me from my enemies, O Lord, for to you I fled. Teach me to do your will, for you are my God. Your good spirit shall lead me in the land of righteousness. For your name's sake, O Lord, enlighten me in your righteousness, for my soul without the tribulation. <coughs> in your mercy, cut off my enemies and destroy all of us who afflict my soul, for I am your servant. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace and will towards men. We praise you, we bless you, we worship you, we glorify you. We give thanks to you for your great glory. O Lord, Heavenly King, God the Father Almighty, O Lord, the only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. O Lord God, Lamb of God, Son of the Father, who takes away the sin of the world, have mercy on us. You who take away the sins of the world, receive our prayer. You who sit at the right hand of God the Father, have mercy on us. For you only are holy, you only are the Lord of Jesus Christ, in the glory of God the Father. Amen. <laughs> Every night will I give thanks to you and praise your name forever and ever. Lord, you have been our refuge from one generation to another. I said, Lord, be merciful to me and heal my soul, for I sin against you. I flee to you. Teach me to do your will, well, for you are my God. For with you is the fountain of life, and in your light we shall see light. But continue your loving kindness to those who know you. Perhaps safe, O Lord, that we may be kept this night without sin. Blessed are you, O Lord God, of our fathers, and praise and glorify you, your name forever. Amen. Let your mercy, O Lord, be upon us as we accept our hope on you. Blessed are you, O Lord, teaching your statutes. Blessed are you, O Master, make me to understand your statutes. Blessed are you, O Holy One, enlighten me with your statutes. Your mercy, O Lord, endures forever and despise not the works of your hands. To you is to praise, to you is to a song, to you is to glory, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. <coughs> I believe in one God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, and of all things visible and invisible. And in one Lord Jesus Christ, the Son of God, the only begotten, begotten of the Father before all ages. Light of light, true God, of true God, begotten, not made of one essence of the Father, by whom all things were made. <coughs> Who for us men and for our salvation came down from heaven and was incarnate of the Holy Spirit and the Virgin Mary and became man. And he was crucified for us under Pontius Pilate and suffered and was buried. <coughs> and the third day he rose again according to the scriptures and descended into heaven to sit at the right hand of the Father. And he shall come again with glory to judge of living and the dead, whose kingdom shall have no end. And in the Holy Spirit, the Lord the eternal life, who proceeds from the Father, who with the Father and the Son together is worshipped and glorified, who spoke by the prophets in one holy chapter in Apostolic Church. I acknowledge one baptism for the remission of sins. I look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. <clears throat> Let us sing to our deliverer who crushed the battle <coughs> by his arm and led Israel through the Red Sea, for he has been glorified. Most holy death will save us. Let the warm ointment from your son dry the decay in my soul and heal the sores of my wounds, O most pure one. For I have ever set my hope in you, putting you forth as my intercessor before your Son, our God. Most holy death, O save us. 
I am like the harlot who has spent my entire life in slothfulness and indolence over you. Because I flee to your protection, I cry out to you with faith, O most pure, save me by your intercession. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. I now plead to you with tears, with sighs, and a heavy heart. Do not overlook me, I beseech you, but by your intercessions, before your Son, pray that I may be delivered from torment on the judgment day. My heart is fixed firmly in the Lord, my strength is exalted in my God. I have opened my mouth wide against my enemies, and rejoice in your salvation. Most holy hill, O oh, save us. Look upon my tears, my heart rending sighs, and my hands upraised and stretched out to you. Be merciful and show compassion to your servant, for I have no other help but you, O lady. Most holy thou, O oh, save us. O birth giver of God, knowing the instability of my nature, I slip each day. O oh, fall into all which is evil, for I find no restraint in myself. Support me and have mercy on me, for I have no other help but you, O oh, lady. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. In judging myself, I find that I exceed all mankind in my transgressions. O wretch that I am, where can I flee except to you, O most merciful? For I have no other help but you, O Lady. I have heard of your coming, O Lord, and was afraid, for being the free eternal God, by your ineffable counsel you took on flesh and came forth from the Virgin. Glory to your condescension, O Christ, glory to your power. Most holy though, O oh, save us. The Ninevites at once obeyed the prophet's forewarning and wept in sackcloth and ashes, thus bringing your son's mercy upon themselves, O all pure one. Therefore I pray to you, move him to mercy that he may overlook my iniquities. Most holy though, O oh, save us. O oh, my wounded mind, for of my own will, O oh, praise one I have been. I have united myself with that which is evil, becoming like one who is senseless and completely heartless, defiling myself with impious deeds. Therefore turn me back, guide me to repentance, and grant me wisdom. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. In humble love I stand before your most pure icon, O all sinless one, beseeching you and praying, do not cast me, the wretched one, from your face but have compassion and save me from all harm, all danger, and every evil. Drive the darkness from my soul, O Christ of God, giver of light, who in times past drove the darkness from the deeps, and grant me the light of your precepts, O word, for at the early dawn I hasten to glorify you. Most holy thou, O oh, save us. O oh, my lawless deeds and transgressions have covered me with filth, making me a hideous dwelling place, hideous to angels and to men, but wash me with my tears, O most pure one, most holy thou, O most save us. As you raise your fervent petitions to your Son, O pure one, on behalf of your unworthy and terribly sinful servant, implore the Savior to grant me absolution of my sins before the judgment. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Never cease to deliver me as I acknowledge my sins and transgressions, which I, the wretched one, have knowingly committed. Thus with sighs I cry out to you, praying, Do not abandon your servant, O lady. As you delivered the prophet from the deepest depths, O Christ God, so also deliver me from my sins. For you are the lover of mankind, and I pray that you may guide my life. Most holy thou, O oh, save us. In the words of the psalmist, O lady, my transgressions are a heavy burden, overwhelming me, and the wounds of my soul, the result of my folly, are foul and festering. Most holy thou, O oh, save us. I have fled to your sanctified temple, as is due, and I stand there, a wretched servant, O lady. Accept my prayers as you accepted the widow's might, O lady. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. O good one, by your loving mercy, extinguish the enemy's flaming sword, as he cunningly wages war against me, craftily bombarding me with arrows day and night. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. I think of the judgment, and am afraid. 
of the dread questioning, I tremble. I am filled with fear at the judge's response, and I dread the tortures, the pain of the fire, the darkness of Gehenna, the grinding of teeth, and the worm which never sleeps. Oh, what will I do when the thrones are set, the books are open, and the deeds laid forth? When that time comes, O lady, be a helper and fervent advocate for me, a worthless servant, who have placed my hope in you. You save the youth from the fire through the angel, and change the thunder and furnace into dew. Blessed are you, O Lord, the God of our fathers. Most holy Theotokos, save us. I lift up the eyes of my poor soul to you, O holy lady, and cry out with longing to your son. O my Savior and Creator, O Christ, who by the intercessions of your mother have compassion on me. Most holy Theotokos, save us. Having you as a wealth of healing, O Virgin, who gave birth to Christ, pour a drop from your abundance upon me, your weak servant, ever grievously wounded. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. O Bride, who has not known wedlock, watch over those who place their hope in you. For if you do not preserve your servants, O Virgin, we shall all perish and become food for the demons. You cover your heights with the waters, and set the sands as a bound to the seas. You uphold all things, the sun lauds you, the moon glorifies you, and all creation offers you praises as the creator of all forever. Most holy Theotoko, save us. When your son will come to judge the whole human race, then deliver your servants, O virgin birth giver. For, O, oh, he shall then separate one from the other, the righteous from the sinners. Most holy Theotoko, save us. O oh, great wonder, O oh, virgin, how have you fed a baby with milk and still showed yourself to be a virgin after giving birth? O oh, lady, truly your wonders are most glorious, and thus we venerate, and we venerate you and extol your indescribable birth-giving. We bless the Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. I have been put to death by the sly one who gnaws at me, but revive me, O you who gave birth to the life of all. And do not let him forcibly torment us who are humble and uncomprehending until our death. Blessed is the Lord, the God of Israel, who has raised the might of our salvation in the house of David, his servant, in which we have been tried. He is the sunrise from the heights, and has set us upon the way of peace. Most holy Theotokos, save us. Your Son and God was lifted up unto the wood as a great might of blessing for us. At his awakening, the deed was torn in two, and the enemy was overthrown and cast down forever. Therefore we magnify you, O most pure, together with your Son and God. Most holy Theotokos, will save us. Beholding the flow of my tears, O lady, be compassionate, and have mercy on my poor soul according to your mercy. Cleanse it, ever preserving it, sheltering it, and snatching it from the clutches of the demons. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. O people, all homes and nations, used together with your virgins, in purity of mind, let us draw near, all who have fed upon the true faith. Let us cry out fervently to the pure and virgin mother of our God. O all holy, save us through your intercessions. It is truly meet to bless you, O Theotokos, ever blessed and most pure, and the mother of our God. More honorable than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Without defilement, you gave birth to God the Word. True Theotokos, we magnify you. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages and ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us, Lord, from us from our sins, Master, pardon our transgressions. O holy one, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages and ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil. Through the prayers of our holy Father, so Lord Jesus Christ, mm -hmm. our walk, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. Most glorious John Chrysostom, the Church of Constantinople, greatly rejoice receiving the gift of your holy relics, keeping them as a treasure of great price. Through your intercession, they bring grace of healing to those who praise you in him. Lord,
Lord, and mercy, 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 O Christ, God, worship and glorify in every season and in every hour in heaven and on earth, long-suffering, deeply compassionate, and greatly merciful, who loves the just and shows mercy upon the sinner, who calls on men to salvation through the promise of blessings to come. Accept, O Lord, our prayers at this hour and direct our lives according to your commandments. Sanctify our souls, cleanse our bodies, order our minds, purify our thoughts, and deliver us from all affliction, evil, and sickness. Count us us about when the holy angels, the guard and the guarded by their legions, we may reach you through the faith and the knowledge of your unapproachable glory for your blessing unto ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. More honorable than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Without the fun which you gave birth to God, the word of truth, they help us we magnify you. In the name of the Lord, Mother of the Mother. And the prayers of our holy fathers. Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. The one who found immaculate and corrupt in the church, <coughs> and the of your virgin bride of God, through your most glorious birth giving, you united by the word to mankind, and joined our fallen human nature to the heavenly. You are the only hope of the hopeless, the aid of the unbound, the ready help to those who run to you and a refuge for all Christians. Do not turn away from me, a sinner who am defiled, even though I have made myself totally useless through impure thoughts, words, and deeds, and who through my slothful understanding have become a slave of the sweet things of this life. As mother of the God who loves mankind, have pity on me, a sinner, and that same love for mankind. Receive the prayer I offer to you with the foul lips and pray to your Son, our Master, and Lord, who is in your eternal boldness. May he open even to me the goodness of his deep love for mankind. May he overlook my countless transgressions, turn me to repentance, and make me an experienced accomplisher of his commandments. Stand by me always in your mercy, compassion, and love of good. Be my fervent intercessor and help in this life, driving off the assaults of enemies and guiding me to salvation. Guard my wretched soul at the time of my death, driving away the dark forms of the evil demons. Deliver me from eternal torments at the day of the awesome judgment. And reveal me an heir of the inexpressible glory of your Son and our God. May I receive this most honored lady, most holy veil to oppose through your help and intercession, through the grace and love for mankind of your only begotten Son, our Lord God and Savior Jesus Christ, to whom in all the glory, honor, and worship, with his Father who is without beginning, and his most holy good and life, free and spirit, now and ever, and unto ages and ages. Amen. As we prepare for sleep, O Master, bring rest to our bodies and souls. Keep us from the dark sleep of sin, from every dark passion and pleasure of the night. Still the impulses and passions, and put out the flaming arrows which the evil and loose is deceitfully against us. Still the rebellions of the flesh, and put to sleep our earthly and material reasonings. O God, grant us an alert mind, chase thoughts, a sober heart, and a light sleep free of every satanic dream. Raise us at the time of prayer, confirming your commandments, the memory of your judgments firmly in us. Grant that we may glorify you throughout this night, singing, blessing, and glorifying your most honorable and majestic name, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages and ages. Amen. O most glorious and ever virgin Mother of Christ our God, take our prayers to your Son and our God, that we may be of our souls. My hope is the Father, my refuge is the Son, my protection is the Holy Spirit, and the Holy Trinity. Glory be to you. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages and ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Mother. Through the prayers of our Holy Father, the Lord Jesus Christ, our Lord, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. Bless me, holy mothers and sisters, and forgive the sins that I have sinned and have committed this day. Indeed, indeed, word and thought. May God forgive you and have mercy on you, Holy Mother. Bless me, Holy Mother, and forgive all the sins I have committed this day. Indeed, word and thought of all my sins is a great for me, God. His grace forgive and have mercy on us. So, what shall we say? What can we say? What are we up for? Great 
think we're up for the one for refuge at this point? Sure. Okay. That, that <clears throat> Thank <laughs> you. 